गुड इवनिंग डियर स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर स्टार्टिंग लेसन टू ऑफ इंग्लिश वन सब्जेक्ट एंड प्रेडिकेट सो लेट इज स्टार्ट अ कंप्लीट सेंटेंस हैज टू पार्ट्स अ सब्जेक्ट एंड अ प्रेडिकेट द सब्जेक्ट इज द नाउन प्रोनाउन और फ्रेज द सब्जेक्ट परफॉर्म्स द एक्शन ऑफ द वर्ब्स also students when we are doing this chapter before this you must know what is noun what is pronoun what is verb and verb two types first one is helping verb and main verb i know you all know very well about these three terms we have already studied in class 4 about noun pronoun and verbs so every sentence has two parts one is subject and predicate All right. So, what is the subject in a sentence? It is a noun, pronoun, or a phrase. Right? What is predicate? The predicate tells us about the subject. It always starts with a verb. When we find a predicate in a sentence, it starts with the verb. here i am presenting you some examples first is max wrote the letter so what is the subject here max is the name of the person also max is performing the verb and the part which tell us about the subject is the predicate my family goes on a picnic subject is my family okay family is performing a verb that is goes and the part which is telling us about the subject is the predicate next the t is hot t is subject is hot is predicate i love toys i is subject and this is predicate the sun is always moving the sun is subject and is always moving is predicate so here uh, it is very clear students that predicate it always starts with a verb here wrote is a verb goes this is the verb is verb so in the same way we can see example of your book also the kite flew high in the sky the kite is the subject flew high in the sky is predicate here flew is the verb the boy put the book on the table the boy is subject put the book on the table is predicate and predicate always starts with the verb so students you can also read this definition and everything will be clear to you i have explained this definition and also you have to read this and uh, read examples thank you so much